Hey, what's up, guys? Oh, man. I wish there was more light in this room, but unfortunately, that's how it is. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? This is going to be a quick stream, maybe 30, 40 minutes. I think I got work later, so unfortunately, I got to gotta get ready for that. I think I got my semi-normal sleep schedule going on, too. Also, uh, you notice that my bottom left is a little bit less uh, <laughs> scuffed looking. All right. Oh, off iron. Hey. Please select your character. Play Johnny today. Let's get to it. Hopefully my internet doesn't explode on itself. Uh, it's been doing all right. Hey, how's it going, Admiral? <laughs> hey, Johnny saved her from being an orphan. I think he gets to do what he wants. I I'm pretty sure that's not how it works. Don't listen to me. <laughs> how are you doing today? Thanks for the follow checks, guy. Clean up my uh, layout a little bit so you can uh, see my Discord name as well if you want to contact me. A little bit less scuff looking. <laughs> I really need a real layout though. Oh my, I got a bot in here. I haven't had those in a while. Oh, another one. So how are you doing today, Kobayashi? You doing okay? Ah, the Litos in a minute. Oh no, it got corrupted. That's unfortunate. It just gets rid of your like, ranks, right? Or did it get rid of your uh, save data too? Oh, he was on the other side. 
Oh, the costume too? No, that's the important part. Screw rank. That sucks. It's okay though, because I'm here with Guilty Gear. I don't know how much that'll make up for it, but... <laughs> Yeah, dude, seriously, rank is not that big a deal. Unless you're trying to fight, like, the big name people all the time, it's it, it doesn't do anything. Let's see... Uh, man. Alright, let's see. Uh, at least I'm getting some good connections today. Nice. Better than yesterday. Hey Oscar, what's going on? Wow, that, I just realized the name isn't lined up 100%. <laughs> ah, that was supposed to be super. Yeah, I know how that is, man. I mean, it's, it's Christmas, right? So, it's probably busy for you. No, I get hit. Get off me. Tried to get away from a grappler in Marvel, and then he ended up making a grappler team anyway. So it's like, whoops. <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, not really a real grappler team, but he had Hagger at the end for the assist. It was playing Set, Hulk Set, and like Dormammu Set. The internet was tripping out like last night. Yeah, even Shiva's command grab, you're right. Um, yeah, I was, uh, the internet was tripping out last night and a little bit today, but I think they fixed it apparently, so. If they haven't, uh, tripped out about it. I should have made it.
M&M's. How's it going, viewers? Thanks for showing up. I'm doing my daily playing of GG. This is going to be a quick stream, unfortunately. Uh, I got to work in my hour and a half. Yo, you're going to get Venom now. I don't want to play Johnny anymore. <laughs> oh. I was trying to figure out what else to put on this layout as well as like uh, I put something ready for like if I'm gonna play with someone in sets like for a counter so I'm really like hey Okrans what's going on hey I I just don't like grapplers man it's almost every game that I end up playing the grappler is my counter math though, and I'm just like, no, why? Or gay. Or actually, it, it's really, it's it's because of Chad. He, he's giving me PTSD. Like, if you don't know him, like, having the, the strongest reading grappler player one of the strongest players in the country for grapplers and just like getting your read every time and you can see the read like you can feel that he's reading you correctly because he, he figured, figured out how you play it's a little disheartening <laughs> Oh yeah, that doesn't work on pot. No. Oops. Whoa, that doesn't work. Yes. Okay. Oh, Okrans, I, I wanted to know uh, who did your layout for your uh, stream. Even though I don't have money, I would. What I was wondering if uh, maybe I could look at. Uh, Maybe their work or something. Get ideas. Oh, okay. Damn, I guess I had to commission you then. <laughs> you see my amazing layout that I made out of like stuff I found on the internet. Like. <laughs> Even before, like, the, the font from the bottom left before was just, like, me going to Microsoft Paint 3D and picking a font and a color. But still just trying to learn how the, how the streaming stuff works in general. Graphic design is my passion. <laughs> what about that animation um, in your transitions for, like, breaks and stuff. Is that you as well? Oh, is it? Huh. That's cool. Alright. Two frames. What? Coward. So I looked up Johnny's coin for uh, for plus R, and the resolution so small for the coin. It's like it's super tiny. I wouldn't be able to get much in there. Because <laughs> I, actually, what I wanted to do was find like um, the the. Um, the ball formations for all the characters. Like, I mean, not ball formations, but ah, uh, more Potemkins. Um, the ball formations for uh for um uh Venom Sin's kill. Oh, 
I also need icons. I really like. I can, I got like two or three subscribers. Like, they, there's no icons for them to spam. This dude. There's so many. Like the reason I had that icon on Abba at the bottom is because uh, I kept instant killing at least one per stream. Like literally one per stream. I can like go back and go back to every stream except for like maybe one. And uh, I instant killed them all at least once. I guess it's uh, because it's Christmas, that's why they have Potemkins coming out everywhere. No, I did not want that. Miss Finder. No! Yashire Soyo. I should look that up. I'm gonna sing it on stream. Oh man, Potemkins. Yeah, I mean, I could just put Venom pull balls like everywhere. <laughs> it, it looks so ghetto. Give this guy at least like two times one of my one one character, because I don't want them to think like, oh, he's rage quitting to play a different one. <laughs> Only sometimes. That reminds me, when are we gonna play? Uh, oh friends. I knew he was gonna first, and then I didn't made it. You know, I was looking through um, when you were running a tournament, and uh, my boy, uh, son of a gun, uh, my boy 405 was in that tournament. I know from back in the day, he's a fellow old man. No! He's a fellow Johnny old man, ask, ask him what's up. Uh. Yeah, man, the Johnny Coalition. Yeah, I figured as much. Ah! I want to pick up my cat and just toss it, just like Potemkin did, but he, would, my cat would not appreciate it. He kind of deserves it though. He bit my ankle earlier today. <laughs> yeah, four or five is good. He's always been super technical. But uh, also like really uh, defensive. 
I told him, I told him that, uh, back in the day, I told him that he should probably push up the offense a little bit more, um, when we used to play a lot. Yeah. He used to put a lot of stuff on his YouTube channel, too, for his bros. I messed up. Ah, man, I'm messing up everything. So the protected should be looking for a chance to flick the ball here in this matchup. And then, then control smash, but I think he's more scared than I'm pressing buttons. <laughs> Oh no! Get away! Oh. Wait, I didn't have meter. Crap! Alright, alright. Okay. Oh my god, he mashed that so hard. Not that there's anything wrong with that. Dude, seriously, uh, a lot of the Venom stuff is not super hard uh, execution-wise, like straight up. I don't. A lot of people get scared, uh, me included, when I was like watching my friends play him sometimes. But uh, generally, a lot of the stuff you need to be doing with Venom is like knock down to the kickball, and then after that, you just work around that, and eventually you'll learn him. He's not really like. He's way less complicated than he seems. He's got the one combo where you have to charge down like instantly, but it's pretty hard. Okay, I respect that. Yeah, I mean, I used to be in that, in that, uh, well, I used to be in the charge character scene hard, and then like when I figured out the design philosophy for a lot of them, it started making more sense. Ah, man. It's just like, it's it's weird for... Venom is like in this weird spot, right? Because a lot of charge characters have at least like, good normals that lead to the like, some crazy stuff. And he doesn't really have like a reversal or anything to get people off of him. He just like, relies on his own pressure to uh, to keep going. And if he's on defensive then, good luck. Oh my god. Autopilot way too hard. Yeah, he's super tight. 
you just, you don't want to be caught in, like, on the receiving end of Venom, usually. <laughs> He's super tight. But, like, the, the biggest thing was, uh, there was a, you know, like, I was a Johnny Bane for years, and then he didn't show up in Exert right away. Um, and I had a small foundation for trying to learn Venom in Slash. And I'm like, okay, I guess, uh, I guess this is the, this is the go. Um, also, I, I had a friend that used to play Venom a lot, and, uh, I took a good bit of it from him. Yeah, it's super tight. He got it in Reload, which is the second game he was in. And, um, it wasn't as big of a deal until, uh, Slash, I think, because that's when it became Charge Balls on hit. Before, it used to just slam, and then, like, uh, he would get the ball while, while hitting the combo, so... Um, you didn't really need it, I think. Just did a little bit more damage, had a ball set out, instead of putting the ball out later. Bad at stick. <laughs> what a god. I think I'm... I think I'm lost against every Potemkin so far. Oh no, I beat the one. But yeah. Ugh. Yeah, I, I do like QV in some instances, but Dubious Curve is way more swag, I think. It's super tight looking. Oh no. I mean, the way the Exert story looked like it was heading, you're probably not going to see him again. But, it's a fighting game, so we might see him again anyway. <laughs> Johnny will always be around, but I don't know if he's going to show up in the first version of uh, Strive. Or, I mean, like, I always have to worry about the way they change up, like, gameplay-wise. See? Changes his inputs and the style so much in Exert. Probably as long as uh as long as Zato is doing what he does. Yeah, Dice K, I don't mean I don't know. I I'm I think I would imagine he has like a big layout of what he was planning to do with like the game, like story wise. And then he just throws stuff out when he eventually gets to it. And then you have these people that have to like consult with him whenever they expand the story with like uh, novels and um, novels and um, and radio dramas and all that stuff. Cause he, they've done a lot. There's like two novels. Two novels, a manga that I, I'm pretty sure no one cares about, and then like um, two radio dramas.
No, Cliff, why? <laughs> yes. This clip is the coolest of all. What? I shouldn't be surprised. Whoa, it, it still goes that far too? Man. Like, I know about the move, but I thought it had like a range. Uh... Whoa. Yeah, you know, he, he not only he only didn't make it because uh, I heard he was the least popular out of the characters in Vanilla. Also, like, you know, the Vanilla story for him had him dying at the end, but, you know, they didn't have to follow that. They just ended up wanting to go that way. But after that, like, they made the sprites for, like, uh... Um, like, console story mode for X. Oh my god. Yeah, Ton Oki's funny. Man, I'm on a losing streak today. Let's see, ugh, streak. Okay. Oh, whoa, I had it on two frames. Son of a gun. Okay, well, it's okay. Oh, he, he went to freaking. Okay, alright. I, like, to be honest with you, there's like, a good bit of the Exer story I don't even remember. And I used to be a really huge lore head for stuff like that. But I could just be getting old. <laughs> I thought he was gonna do like right stop. <laughs> no. This guy's in chat. He does what he wants. Oh no. No. Two D, you failed me. He's doing it on purpose. It's funny though, so I'll forgive him. Wonder what I do there. I do. I guess I do. I guess I would do like dubious curb or six uh, K dubious curb. Yeah, I'm. I'm upset. I missed a lot of uh, Kusuru uh, when he was in the states. Um, I missed him playing Guilty Gear because I, I was. Uh, I was in Marvel Three mode at the time. But uh, I became friends with him, he was super cool.
2D RC wall throw. <laughs> What what I'm uh, I'm looking forward to is being able to do that in um, Strive, because the slowdown doesn't happen if the the RC burst area doesn't hit. So you could probably do that with. That's gonna be funny as hell. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Freaking wild throw nonsense. Cyborg is such a cool move. How did we end up with like Exert Soul? <laughs> Back to basics. Not getting too many hits. I might have to do a lobby. Well, I personally can't, cause like, like uh, the way it looks like um, when they were making a uh, exer was that they went and used like the reload template for a lot of characters. So that's why a lot of characters lost a good bit of their moves. You know, it, hilariously, um, Mori from the Blaze Blue, um, um, Mori from Blaze Blue fandom, he actually, uh, started working on Slash and AC, and he, he's the one that put all the wild nonsense in the, the later games, after Reload. Cause Daisuke didn't really work directly after, well, on Guild Gear after, uh, Reload for the updates after that. As a as a battle planner anyway. He still designed and voice acted and did the music and you know everything else <laughs> a game designer would normally have like other people do. You know the what's the worst offender though? I heard uh I always heard um, there was a story about the person, like, uh, Elfelt's design apparently was influenced a little bit by uh, Pachi coming down to Texas and some of the Texas player, like a Texas player bringing him to a shooting range. Dude, no, no one, no one has not liked Daisuke's soul voice. I'm so upset that he took it away, like, I mean, he wants to be all modest and like, I don't want to compete with like, these professionals or whatever. I'm like, bro, your your soul voice is too iconic, man. And then hearing him say a uh, volcanic viper in person is like, it's like music to my ears, man. It's so good. Nah, I'm gonna still play Johnny, I guess. Yeah, no, like, like I don't think he probably can't voice act like the actual story scenes, which I I understand why they got uh, what's his face to do it. And he's a pro, you know, like that, like he's, he's good at it. Um, but I don't like, for like raw, raw, like, uh, power nonsense stuff, like, I think Daisuke Soul has a beat, for Soul anyway. I mean, plus it's, it's him, he's the Gilded Gear, like, like, dude, <laughs> it's, it's hard not to imagine him being Soul bad guy, you know? Instead, we just get him doing bit pieces of voice acting. Uh, I can't remember. I know he did, like... I don't know what else he's done since, uh, Soul. Um, I know he did, like, a nonsense part in, um, Guild Gear 2, like, one of the minions. One of Soul's minions. I think Blockhead or Pencilhead or something like that. It just, it's so deep, it's so deep, and I, I prefer him as like, uh, that voice actor as a villain, because he's like Kurei in, uh, 
He's Kurei in, um, uh, what is it, uh, Fate, Fate Stay Night. So it's super weird to hear him as a uh, soul bad guy, but the thing is, a lot of the Guilty Gear casting was kind of like opposites too. Um, like, uh, I think, uh, Eno's voice actor was known as Bell Dandy in, um, that one anime I can't remember the name of offhand, but she's like an Ara Ara mom, and then you have her like cursing and saying lewd stuff. And then you have Nori Wakamoto doing Johnny, who's known for being a villain for a lot of his uh, typecasting, so. Yeah, freaking the Tempkins, man. Yeah, dude. Eno you know, you know, used to be an Ara Ara mom character, voice actor. Oh yeah, she's super hot. I was pretty hyped when I found out uh, who Venom's voice actor was too. I was like, oh shit, he's Archer from Fate. That's cool. Why you have that uh, music motif for your uh, Twitch layout? This is pretty tight. Oh no, that was not tight enough. It's really good though, it's a good layout. I was pretty impressed when I ran into your stream. No, I'm losing viewers. Oh, whoa, I put it on three frames, son of a bitch. Alright. It's tight though. Let's see. Frame delay against Potemkin. Yay! I think it happened to me for like two more fights, but I gotta, I gotta go for real. Surprise. 
you didn't burst yet. No! Get off me. <laughs> no one errors like it's a boy at the orbit. Sweet. Yeah, sometimes you just gotta throw the curveball. They're like, oh, he's playing he's playing legit. And you do full screen dashing move and they're like, what did he do that for? And I just have to shrug my arms. Oh no. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Oh wow! It's 60B by 60B. For sure, though. Let's see, is this guy gonna soul me? I get it with Johnny. I don't know if he's expecting me or not. Well, I was not expecting the Venom pick. It's all good, though. Okay, let's go. Oh, 
Hawkins Radar. I still never learned that combo. Hey, what's up, Rorik? I this is actually my last match for today. I was meeting up. <laughs> I'll see you later, man. This guy's probably like, man, your venom suck. I'm gonna show you a real venom. Oh no, what am I doing? Okay. I messed up my FRC twice. Wow, 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 wow. There you go, Are you happy? I didn't get beat on. How about that? <laughs> He's good though. I guess he has a bunch of mains or something. Okay, well, unfortunately, I have to call it a day. Uh, I gotta get to work. Um, I'll try to stream around the same time, give or take tomorrow. I've been waking up early, so I'm back on my, my daily schedule, so. <sighs> um, and then this week we have uh, Christmas off, so. Um, I might have, I have Christmas day and the day after off. So I might stream a little bit longer than usual. Anyway, I'm gonna head out. I'll see you guys later. Thank you for watching.